Hey fam, this is Chef Tiara, and today we're gonna to use these simple ingredients to make pistachio and ice cream. Let's get started. The full recipe will be featured on my website. Just click the link above. The first thing we're going to do is pour all of our ingredients into the blender. Make sure your coconut creamer is cold. I usually pre-freeze my avocados. However, this time I didn't. It's great to have frozen avocados with this recipe. It will help your mixture stay cool and it will cool down faster when it's an ice cream maker. Now that we have all our ingredients in the blender, let's start blending, why don't we? If you have a Vitamix, make sure not to overblend because you can actually heat up your mixture and you want ice cream, not hot cream. <laughs> Now that the mixture is blended, it's time to transfer it to the ice cream maker. If you don't have an ice cream maker, you can actually place, a, place it in a bowl over ice and mix it with a spatula until it's somewhat frozen. Every ice cream maker is different, so you must follow the manufacturer's direction on whatever ice cream maker brand that you have. With this type of old fashioned ice cream maker I have, I have to use ice salt to keep it frozen. You can actually purchase this ice salt from any grocery store. Once you pour your mixture into the ice cream maker, let it churn for about 30 minutes to an hour, just depending on the type of ice cream maker that you have. Remember, always follow the manufacturer's directions. After 30 minutes have passed, your ice cream will be firm but not fully frozen. And that's the perfect texture you want. Now, transfer it into a loaf pan and pop it into the freezer for about two to three hours or overnight, depending on what time of day or night you're making your ice cream. Once your nice cream is fully frozen, it's ready to scoop. Serve and enjoy. And there you have it, pistachio nice cream. 100% nutritious, delicious, and it's very nice to your body and you won't have the bubble gut after eating this dessert. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and leave a comment. Please let me know how this recipe turned out for you. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. See you guys on the next video. Bye.